Good evening, I'm Kirk Gugsell. Today at Jasper High School, powerlifter Sammy Ireland signed a scholarship to compete for McKendry University. Ireland on how he got started in the sport and how it all works. I started working out at, uh, in strength class here and I said I liked it and then I just went to Fitfield at the River Center and then uh, I decided I liked that and then we, a new gym opened up in Huntingburg, Indiana and uh, they're the owner of the gym, Greg Hirsch, he's the powerlifting coach, and he decided that um, I'd be a good fit onto his team, so he decided to take me on as an athlete. And um, he's been coaching me for the last two years, and he, uh, this, we've just been doing powerlifting since then. What's a powerlifting event like? What's, what's the format? What do you do? Um, so to start out, you go into a 10-week prep period. That's whenever you, um, you push your body to like max fatigue, then you kind of recover. You kind of get your body up to its peak when it, while it is recovering. And then you go and lift at about eight o'clock in the morning, you weigh in, and then you start lifting about 11 o'clock, and then you do squat, bench, deadlift. And then at the end of the day, they add up all the totals, and then they hand out um, awards for whoever wins their weight class and division, then overall um, winners. What impressed you about McKendry? Um, they're, they're a Division II school, but they are top five in the country for powerlifting. Um, within the last, or the last three years, they've been top five in collegiate nationals. And then this year, they're going for number one, though. And I think they could win it. And also, they do have the number one powerlifting program in the country, so. Are those, what are those contests like at the collegiate level? Um, I'm not really too sure yet. I haven't been able to ask around, but um, what I do know is they do send about one to two athletes from each weight division, and they have them just compete against other colleges, and whoever wins, wins.